guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to reading to episode 9 of Demon Slayer, so let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm. Mm. Mm, I'm taking a nap after this. I'm getting up, gotta go do adult ish, and then finally now coming home like, what, 30 something minutes ago? Tired as fuck. Hot too. My thing is, how the fuck are you gonna kill these two? I mean, you could throw that ball that she's using back at her, like... Maybe, I don't know. But then you gotta think about the arrow demon, too. You know, I honestly thought he was going to say, no, be a little careful, because, you know, that demon's over there, too, so. <laughs> Damn. Cody, oh my god, don't do that, dog. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Dude, I'm so like fucking race cars. I mean, if she could do that too, imagine if she had. Holy my god! Imagine what she could do with four. Mm -mm. Like, that thing going, like, what? How much the car is going that far? Like, 100 miles per hour, even more? Go lay down, Cody. Go lay down. Lay down. I'll play with you in 30 minutes. 
Lay down. Go, go, go. I mean, but also, what about Nesco? Nesco gonna come out, kick some ass, you know, roll house kick. Do not come over here. Jesus, man. Damn. Oh, that is... Mm. Okay, okay, mm hmm. Between this and Attack on Titan, mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. True. Gotcha. Is she making more? Oh God! She, I told you, she got more. She got six. Mm -mm. Dude, it's like that freaking, what's that game that they play in, in the gym and then they in the room? Racquetball! There we go! That's what that's like. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Just worry about yourself. <laughs> mm -hmm.
Jesus. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. When that's go finally came out. Is it weird that she kind of reminds me of Himiko? Except the fact is, like, you know, she ain't obsessed with blood and ish. But. Mm. Thank God. Jesus. My baby is going up so much. I love him. Mm. And then you have two just come out of nowhere. I think it's perfect. And okay, let's talk. Of course, she's just gonna magically go her freaking arms back like nothing. Mm -hmm. And she got more of them. Jesus. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Oh.
you know, that he might do something. Yeah. Damn. See, it's like, even if he attacks from behind, something might happen, so then you're fucking sc Oh my god! See, now it looks like she's just freaking playing dodgeball. Oh, damn. Excuse me. Yeah. Well, maybe if he runs around, if the arrows, we now know the arrows that follow him. If he runs around, then maybe if he stands in front of dude and moves just at the right moment, no, but then they still follow him. So, time you know, fuck, you just screwed.
Ugh, that's one. Okay, number one. It is a little messed up that, like, once Nezuko kicked it, yet her leg fell off, and then she's very slow healing instead of the other two, which really sucks until, you know, once we give her the medicine, and hopefully that'll make, you know, her heal a little bit faster because, like, honestly, I need her to kick this thing's ass. Like, I'm sorry. Ugh. I can't. I, I love that episode. It's good. It's just like, I like, I'm not saying that the show ends at, like, cliffhangers like Attack on Titan does or, um, kind of how with Overlord that I'm currently watching now or even Monogatari. But there are points when they do it, and it's, like, getting really, really good, and then you, like, you look at the time, and you're like, it's about to end in three, two, one, done until next week. And you're just like, just give me more. Why can't, like, with this show, I kind of wish it was 45 minutes, but then I think if they did it by a 45-minute episode, I think it would have been less episodes for this series. I think it would have probably been done, like, 12 or 16 episodes. I don't know. But, oh, I just need that to go, to go back out there and kick some ass. I mean, you know, my roadhouse kick, baby. I love her so damn much. And she's, she's so freaking precious. Get the blood. Test the blood on Nezuko and just keep going. fucking cute. I mean, honestly, like, when I was thinking, while I was watching it, like, once when Dude got hit, I'm thinking, like, okay, if these three demons get hit, they're gonna be fine. They ain't gonna, like, lose an arm for a second and then regenerate. Nah, I, I mean, like, watching him and having his head come back, yeah, that was a little weird. I, like I said, between, you know, the, the kind of the regeneration in Attack on Titan versus this. I don't know which one is more creepier. I, I You know what? Honestly, I kind of have to say this. Because that was really disgusting. <laughs> I mean, with Ryder, and like you see his skin. And like the outline of the skull and stuff. I don't want to see that. I mean, as someone who really likes watching um videos of like... <laughs> Not surgeries, but, like, when bones are popping on an ish, like, I'm okay with that, but, like, I don't know why, like, when they do it in an anime, I get really creeped out and grossed by it. I don't know why. It, it just, mm. Like, when I, like, anytime when I would watch a show called Scarred, and, like, somebody would, like, break a hand, or uh, a finger, or their foot, or their leg, and it just pops out, and then, like, it's squirting, and I'm just like, oh, that's freaking cool. And then in anime, I'm like, I don't know how to feel like that, but, like, especially when it was just going, and I was just like, oh, okay, interesting, but kind of gross, but that's how our body is, and just, okay, uh, but this is a really good episode, but it's like, damn, I just, I need Nezuko's leg to hurry up and fucking heal, I need her to kick some butt, and I need them to just move on from this and go find more of the, um, 12 Demon Moons, uh, extract their blood, bring it back to the, um, I'm about to say Tamoyo, but that's the wrong name. Tamayo. And um, her apprentice and test it more on Nezuko's blood and see how it counteracts with each other. And 
possibly, hopefully, before this series ends. Because we're not even at the halfway point of it yet. Like, in, like, two weeks we will. Um... Try to get something, and then if we get to a point, like I said last week, if she, um, if they have the cure for her, and Tanjiro was like, yeah, big plan is just to make Nezuko back into a human, but at the same time, as I was thinking, what if Nezuko does not want to be a human anymore? She looks at, um, What's the Face and The Apprentice as her mother and, um, her brother, so of course, automatically, no matter what, she's going to protect them because they seem like family to her, and everyone else who isn't, you know, gotta get the hands and gotta get the feet, too, but, mm, good ass episode, I just hate the fact that, you know, she was about to play kickball from hell, and she lost her damn life, like, like, oh, because I felt that. That in the freaking, not really the head I thought I was, like, I was like, ooh, but that leg, I felt that. And that fucking hurt. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction review towards episode 9 of Demon Slayer. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys all officially next Saturday for episode 10. Bye, guys.